Okay, so you want to export a list of all of the videos on your YouTube channel. For whatever reason, you need to track them and you don't want to manually enter every video in. That's fine, there is a way to do this. It's not done through YouTube, however, so you can't go in here and select all your videos and hit export and something like that. What you need to do is go over to takeout.google.com. And so on takeout.google.com, make sure that you are in the correct profile. So in my case, I've got multiple YouTube channels under different Google accounts. Make sure you're on the right one. Once you've done that, you'll have these options down here, which is all of the stuff that you can export from your Google account. Deselect all because we don't need to export all of it. What we just want is all the way down at the bottom, YouTube and YouTube music. So you wanna check that one. It's gonna give you some options of what you can export from your YouTube and music account. So click on that. So you can, if you want, select everything, but we don't actually want that for the purpose of what we're doing here today. So I'm gonna deselect all, and the one I want is videos. That's gonna give me that Excel file. It's also going to give me all of the videos as well. So that's okay. I'll show you what to do here on the next screen so that you're not necessarily getting all of the videos at once. Hit okay and then just go next. On this next screen, we have where to send it to. So we're just gonna choose link via email. And what it'll do is it'll actually email you the link to your Google account. I'm gonna go once, cause I just want it once. File type zip. And now I'm gonna leave the file size to two gigs. You can go up to 50 gigs and it's gonna be a pretty large file that you're gonna download, which will take forever because basically it's gonna to try to include every single video. If you just choose two gigs or even one gig really, what it'll do is it'll automatically choose up to that number of videos as well as the Excel file. And I'll show you what I mean here. I'm gonna click create export. So in my case, I've got this top option here, your latest export and most recent. So I actually did this a few days ago and um, I need to do it again today. So down here, we've got this option of export progress. So it's gonna tell you that it's in the process of creating these files. Let's go over to the export. So what you will receive is an email. It'll look like this. And it's gonna say download one of 85. So it's giving you a whole bunch of stuff to download, which is basically gonna be all of the actual videos on your account. So just select the first one, one of 85. It's gonna confirm your login. And it gives you, here we go, download data. So you can see it's actually downloading it. And we just want to let it work its magic. You can hit download as well if you need to. Um, but in my case, it automatically started to download it. So I'm gonna stop this because I've actually already downloaded it. I should add this email, might take a day or so before they finally send it to you. So if the, you have a lot of data or videos on your account, be patient, this won't come right away. So I'm gonna jump over to my downloads folder and in my downloads folder, I have takeout. This is, that's this one right here. You right click and extract, take out, and you can extract it into the same place where you have it. I've already done this, as mentioned, and it gives you this takeout folder. Double click on it, and it gives you YouTube and YouTube Music. This is where I mentioned that it gives you videos. It gave me a certain amount of videos, not all of them. You'd have to like download each one if you want videos, but we don't want videos. We want that video data, that Excel data. Double click on that, and there you go. You've got your video Excel data. So as you can see, it gives me the name. Let's just scroll to the top here. It gives me the title of the video, the status, when it was created, how long it is. You get the description, which is nice, what category it's in, and uh, how many times it's been viewed, dislike, like. So all kinds of good data that you can use within here. And it's all videos. So notice just going on and on and on here to all the videos on the account. So even though it actually only downloaded eight videos, the Excel file includes everything. And uh, that's why you only need to go with like one or two gig files so that you don't have to spend forever downloading a whole bunch of videos that you don't really need because all you want is the Excel file.